soy parte. Nice. Nice, nice. Okay. Nice. I already got mixed up on who had who's who had max meter. Pressure. Fighters ready. Engage. Uh oh. That just completely shut down any chance of me doing the EX, apparently. Mm. Nice cross up. Yeah, the spacing down on that shit. Nice. Sean, what are you doing? Look the right way, please. Oh my gosh. Really? I'm surprised he hasn't done it yet. Playing this patient is not doing me any favors. Oh, no EX. I'm getting fucked up here. Nice work. Brown Dog takes that one. So Brown Dog takes that 2-0. Alright, this is game one. We have Ryu versus Alex. Alex gets the grab. Overhead tech, okay. 
Another grab. Tech. The dive. The cross chop. Alright, back full screen. Tech's good play from both players here. Drops the combo. Goes right over his head. Ryu not out of this. Tries the double Jodan. I don't know what that was. Gets sweet though. Are you ready? Go. Whips the elbow. That's a punish. Backed into the corner now. Lots of whiffing going on. Okay, alright. Stomp is blocked. Throws in the corner. What's his for breakfast? Good pressure. Overhead. Gets out of the corner. Uh, 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 uh. Don't drop it. There you go. Maximize that damage. Blocks the cross up. Excellent block. Jumps over that. Ooh, nice tags. Nice tags. Catches them with the light of the mid elbow. Hadoku. It's gonna be match number two, round one. Blocks the Shoryu. Uh, it wasn't the best punish, but we'll take it. It's a heavy. Any damage is good damage. Alright. Corner pressure. Not, he, he committed with that. Commits with the lows. Big damage. Third time. Doesn't commit. Uh, 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 uh. Blocks it. Excellent tech. He's not out of this at all. Oh my goodness. He should have went for the, just the light crouching into the Shoryu or something that was chipped. Loses that round. Alex is coming in with the pressure. Tech. Throw tech. Misses the shoulder. Good option though. Another throw tech. All right, fighting back out to neutral. Back to mid-screen now. Lots of trading going on, but it's in Ryu's favor right now. And he gets the buttons out there, gets that round. One apiece, final round, game two. Baba Nush needs this to stay in the winner's side. Gets knocked out with the chop. Overhead. Nice pressure. Is maintaining this corner pressure. Very well done. The wake up super lands. Uh, 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 okay, alright. Bigfoot. Safe, safe. What's he gonna do now? Here comes the overhead. Blocked. Oh boy. Don't let it end this way. Tech. Oh my goodness. That was an excellent game. The Tekken at? Nah, we ain't playing no Tekken around here. Because Tekken 7 is kind of whack for real, in my opinion. So here we go Sasuke Nagano versus Trident. Message from Smoking Beast. Put you in. Yo, calm down, yo. <laughs> calm down. Let me take a look at uh, where are you anyway? You're gonna be playing against Chilamaki at some point. But it's gonna be a while before y'all play. So sit tight. Alright, Fusion, appreciate you being a part of the tournament. I don't know if you were still in the brackets, in the loser's bracket or not, but if you were, I'm going to assume that you're no longer interested in participating in the tournament because you're heading out. Either way, appreciate you being here. Appreciate you taking part in it. We have just some domination going on with Sasuke Nagano right now. I wasn't even paying attention. Chalamaki, if, if you're asking if you're up next, not yet. Okay, I'm about to say. Super, yeah. Sasuke Nagano, man. This dude is a problem. He's a problem. 
He's keeping the corner pressure to overhead. Gotta watch that. No tech. Gets hit. Unanswered air Tatsumaki. Okay, the wake up. Get off me. But now he's in the corner. Okay. Gets out of the corner. What are you gonna do? Alright, some answers with some buttons. This crafty, crafty setup. Yeah, Tekken 7 is just... I don't like it. Everything they added and changed about the game, I think, has just made it inferior. No super confirmed, but that's alright. Trident is going in this round. Okay. Gets hit with the shore, you. The momentum is shifting. Ooh. My man has this. That was fast as shit. That dive kick. He wasn't trying to let him win that round. Sasuke takes that. You don't see Super 2 from Ibuki very often, so this is always interesting. Dudley with the corkscrew blow. O often considered the best super for him. Nice anti-air. Wakes up with the EX. Another EX, excellent overheads. Burfy is now rocking with the best, man. Appreciate that follow, bro. Engage. Nice, nice. Okay. Ooh, the cross counter. Beautiful. Okay, excellent punish. Nice tag. No super, nothing else after that. That might cost him. There's the rose. Corkscrew blow. Ooh, man. Don't let it end this way. Anyone's game, the elbow. Excellent stuff by Dudley, staying in there. Yeah, Ibuki, I thought she had free super. She could have had something there, but she played with her food. Could not seal it out, but now she's got corner pressure. Working on a perfect right now. Duffed. Text the low. Ooh, okay, well that's fine. Got some corner pressure, he's out of the corner. Right back to neutral. Ibuki working her way back in. Tech tag, nice tag. Nice. Dudley's not having it right now. Trying to fight his way out. Okay, nice. Ibuki doing some nice pressure right now. Works his way out the corner. Nice punish. Dash punch into corkscrew. Oh nope, not yet. Wow, and I think Ibuki was in chip territory for that corkscrew blow if he had actually pulled out the dash punt. Tournament we've been trying to get going here. And now we're in the game too. So we see a little color change. He's feeling a little brighter right now. Let's see if it gives him the extra little bit of extra edge he needs right now. Alright, that was a punish. Tech. That cross counter parry is not working out right now. Ooh, fails to punish the cross-up. Wow! Free blast. Free blast. Okay. The empty jump in the super takes that round. Corkscrew blow. Nice whip punish. Wow, the overhead. Duffed. Buki working way back in. Backswing blow. Backswing. Ugh, one, two, three. The combination. Overhead cross up. Cross up. Uh, uh, uh. How fast did he build that super? Sheesh. That's a punish. Anyone's game. Overhead. The universal overhead. You can't go wrong with the people. You win. This is going to be our official set. The last one was Null and Void.
Nice tech. Nice parry. Ah, oh, that's unfortunate. Nice. Mm, mm -hmm. Nice. Oh, wow. I cannot get any of these grabs. I'm not even taking them. This is gonna be a little challenging. I fought a lot of Hugos, but not with this kind of speed. Oh wow. I jumped that, but okay. I cannot, I can't get that move off. I can't. Takes round one. That was a super. Ooh, the pump fake! Got him! That's the pump fake right there. It's a street exclusive. Not gonna find that anywhere else. Nice tech! Oh my goodness. That was a super. I tried to jump that. Son of a ah. This is a challenging match right now. No, Mr. Mar Mr. Milton, this is actually one of the tracks from the original game. Yeah, when I play Street Fighter Third Strike, I actually don't play my own music, because this game actually has really good music. Unlike games like Mortal Kombat 11, but here we go, Makoto seems to be dominating the match. Relentless pressure into the super! Let it be known that super is not easy to connect like that. That's like a very frame-specific super. 
Mr. Smooth not out of it yet. Round two. Lots of whiffing. Lots of crouching heavies by Makoto. Text the grab. Into the corner. What's for breakfast? Into the overhead. Uh oh. Uh. Uh. Makoto takes that very quick match. 77 seconds on the clock. believe is a 12 user that it's his best super gives him the most options the most meter to play with some anti-air options some combo tools similarly for Urian super 3 the Aegis reflector is considered his best and one of the strongest if not the strongest super in the whole game incredibly difficult to get around this pressure right now from brown dog now Urian has the corner that's where he wants him Trying to get his Aegis Reflector. Nice tech. Cannot grab because of the, the cancel on the flight. Headbutt. Ooh, cross up. Anyone could take this game right now. Tex. Ooh, nice work. I know exactly what he was going to go into after that light. Crouching light into the axes. 12 takes that first round. Here we go. Round two. Some instant air flight cancels from 12 on the side. Excellent empty jump into the light. This 12 is playing really unpredictably. That's what you want to do with 12. Excellent tech on the overhead. Heavy. Empty jump into the low. Anti-air. All right, Urian working his way in here. Ooh. Urian on his last legs here, but it's not over. All he needs is one right hit, but it's hard for him to find it right now, fighting this 12. 12 finds his way out of the corner. Urian has to come to 12. Uh-oh, that's exactly what he wanted. If Urian was able to keep those timer smashes going, he would have been able to save that super, but he goes ahead and uses it to secure the round. It's one apiece. Urian has no super. He has to find other ways to get his pressure going here. That's a punish. No punish. Oh. Let me tell you something. If you get hit in the air with one of those as 12, you could lose half your life. If someone knows how to timer smash effectively. Uh, uh. Misses the headbutt. Empty elbow. Anyone's game right now. That stun is really starting to pile up. Urian cannot figure out how to beat out these hitboxes right now. Uh oh. Urian getting awfully close to what he wants. Oh, Urian is looking for that timer smash to use the Aegis Reflector. Ooh, I cannot believe that actually beat out the me EX headbutt. Crazy. Nice. I tried to block that. I definitely didn't block that in time. Good stuff. Into the heat of battle. Go for it. Okay, I see what I'm I see something I'm not doing.
Woo! He messed up my shot. Nice. Okay. Okay. Hmm. I tried to do an EX and it didn't work. That was a good game. Match of top eight losers right now. So we're gonna be moving up to top four, I believe, here next. Top six, we're gonna be moving up. So here we go. <laughs> First game, Mr. Penguin, Luke is here. Um, Oro versus Makoto. Mr. Penguin is just moving like he's in hyperspeed right now. Oro trying to slow her down. And that's definitely gonna slow her down. Nice. Ooh, Makoto just you saw how fast the momentum shifted. Excellent tech to throw. Great option. Getting with the 50-50. She's looking for the overhead chop. It's not happening. Engage. Here we go. E meter burn. EX chicken wing. Alright, here we go. What's she gonna do? Wow, still the conversion. Here's another one. You have to eat that. Oro's on a rampage. Raises his hand in victory. Six hit combo. That was a pretty fast pace. Nice tags. Nice tags. The walk up grab. Are you ready? Go. Nice, nice. Nice tech. He was looking for that too. <laughs> That's gotta suck.
Got her. All right, I'll take game two. Don't play with your food. Nice. Just all you gotta do is get a counter hit. That'll seal the deal. Round two. Mmm, that range. Nice tech. No, sir. That was a super! Oh, that sucks. I needed that, too. Nice buttons. Free Blast gets that, man. Good stuff. So Free Blast takes that 2-1. Uh, See, I got that, Sasuke. I was just trying to make sure that I knew what was going on with you and Dink, man. I guess y'all are going to play after the next match. So I'll keep the winner of this in here and bring Free Blast in. Cause I guess that's what we're doing. Or are you and Dankman gonna play more? What's going on there? So Oro is doing some work, but 12's finding his way back here. Nice pressure. Nice. Nice. As you see, Brown Dog style a little different from mine, but all Oro needed was that one opportunity, and he got it. He jumps off into the night for round two. Nice pressure. Yeah, give me the update. What's going on? Okay. Roger, Roger. Technically, wouldn't this be quarterfinals then? Because the next match is going to be semifinals. Because whoever loses the winners is going to go down for losers finals. But here we go. 12 is being very crafty, as all good 12s do. Excellent move. All you need is one hit. Final round. Go for it. Okay, well, look at this. Some interesting barrel rolls going on from Oro. Never seen anybody do super jump backwards with that before. Alright, here we go. Starting his offense. Blocks the overhead successfully. Wow, the way he contorted his hitbox. Excellent dodge by Brown Dog. Excellent uppercut. Excellent sure you. Gets it stuffed. That's gotta hurt. Uh uh uh. Okay, Oro, I see you. Nice. I didn't tell Free Blast Newt a good games. I need to do that. I'm not sure if he's watching the stream or not. Alright, we got some EX axes. Uh oh. You're in trouble. What are you gonna do here? Oh, that's a punish? Yep. The only option was to sure you can right there. Whatever that move is for him. Absolutely, it does count if it's KO. So Brown Dog needs this win. Looks like Free Blast backed up in terms of respecting the connection there. We're still going though. The connection looks good. So hopefully it doesn't spurt. Look at this pressure, the overhead, the grab. Wow. Uh, this mofo here. 
All right, free blast. I see you. Round dog, you gotta pull something out here. The text. Lights. Gets grabbed. 12 has to find a way to get in there, but you can also become scared to press a button with this guy's ability to tech. You have to find crafty options. Doing all right now. Mabuki's probably gonna look for her opportunity to get that set up for the super. All right. Doing well, Brown Dog, keep it alive. Yep, those universal overheads, you can't go wrong with it. Excellent timing on his moves, too. Final round. Now. Yeah, Free Blad, I don't see any. I've seen one other Ibuki, I think Arcade Sabbath, who's decent. But I think I've never seen Ibuki as good as Free Blast. And I think Free Blast has some other characters, too. I think he also plays uh, Remy, I think. Very high level. Again, it's been a long time since I played him, but he's a very high level player overall. 12 is dominating this round. He's got this, but wait a minute now. Wait, I spoke too soon. Wow, the pressure on this guy. Okay. Nice. 12 edges that one out. You win. I think we have a game. how this one goes. He's got the home court advantage. Alright, round one. Here we go. Excellent text by Dank Man on those fireballs. Some trading going on. Right, here we go. Sasuke gets his pressure started. Excellent overhead. Can't take it all. This is the cross chop. Uh, good throw. Duffed. Okay. Alright. That throw setup, man, is hard to react to. Sasuke takes that first round. Alright, here we go. Round two. Catches him with the fireball. Gotta watch that cross up. Gotta do something about this pressure. Can't let him be all over your head like this. Overhead. Gotta watch out for that raging demon out of the overhead, too. Could not jump that stun gun headbutt. Uh, uh, good damage. Does not block the cross up. Alright, here we go, final round. Elbow. Ooh, the overhead, the empty overheads. They may have some trouble dealing with this pressure. It's a lot. There's that overhead in the Raging Demon I talked about, but he successfully evades it, but takes a bunch of damage. Uh, uh, okay. Wait a minute now. Nice pressure. Alright, so that first game, Hyper Bomb. Interesting. Let's see if he can find the right time to catch it. Now, interestingly enough, it looks like the connection took something of a hit there. Hey yo, that guy. Right. 777, you're now rocking with the best, bro. Appreciate that follow. Hope your weekend is going well. Welcome to this fabulous Third Strike Online tournament that's been going back and forth in terms of connection issues and lobby issues, but we're really getting down to the nitty gritty here. This is the final four sets of the tournament. Both players are doing their best to manage with the lag. I don't know where that came from. The first match was very clean between them, and this match is a lot slower. So here we go, round two. Dodges the fireball with the elbow. That's about the best punish you're gonna get off that move. That Tatsumaki is very hard to punish very thoroughly. Alex having a lot of trouble keeping Akuma out of the air with those air fireballs. Does not check the fireball there. Here's the pressure by Akuma. Stops blocking too early. This is not where Alex wants to be. In the there it is, that overhead raging demon. And the classic throw setup. And the crouching fears. Alright, so there it is, man.
Super 3 versus, interestingly, Yang. I don't know if we've seen Yang from Dankman yet. I believe Dankman's been staying Alex. Could there be something in this matchup that is making him want to use Yang? It's not working well for him so far. Ibuki's putting on work right now. Okay, wait a minute. Yang having trouble starting an offense. The kunai. Standing one. Standing light, Ibuki takes that round one. The cross up. Nice tech. No punish. I don't know how this man's teching like that. But sometimes that's the difference between great. I think that's the difference between great players and amazing players when it comes to their drag. Sometimes a great player can beat an amazing player, but. So out of nowhere, lag coming in here. It may be coming in too late to make a difference in terms of this match, but wait a minute. Overhead. He gets the grab. Hmm. Uh-oh. All he has to do is a sweep. Yep, heavy. That's all you needed. That connection took a steaming... I don't know what happened at the end, I think. Game two. Okay. Some jumping around by Buki. She's trying to get something started, looking for her opportunity. Flat. Okay, Mrs. the kunai, but gets some pretty good damage. That was an interesting miss with the target combo. Not really sure what went wrong there. Boogie trying to keep pressure. And miraculously, the game looks like it's, just, it's running like 50% faster. The connection is straight now. But inconsistent. I told you what, that those throws by Dank Man... I've never seen a character getting more mileage out of the throws. Not even command grabs, just normal throws. Working very well for Dinkman. Pressure by Buki. Has the corner. Alright, taking some steps back. Regaining her composure. Blocks the EX elbow. Completely safe. At least in this matchup. Okay, nothing hits. Nothing hits. Tries to whip punish. Misses it. Okay, overhead. Interesting. That was a pretty good... I like what Ibuki did there. Jumped right in the beginning after seeing that. Look at that beautiful command string. Target combo. Here we go, final match of this ra of final round of this match. This is game two. Free blast is up one. This is best of five. So notice the lag just came back. We're once again in water. Very even right now. Something we've noticed is that Alex has not gotten off one stun gun headbutt this match, I don't believe. That would really help him here. No super on that punish. What's Ibuki gonna do now? Uh oh. One kunai. Free blast is up 2 0. -oh. Dink man, great job coming in third place, man. Great showing. I'm not sure I've ever played you before, but you did a great job in this tournament. So thank you for participating and being a part of it. Akuma has the home court advantage. Could this be a strength factor for him? This pressure, no text. Free Blast has been doing it. Was, look at that.
He's been doing an outstanding job with the text. Wow, excellent interrupt. Look at that. Hitbox. So it's going to be a big deal for Free Blast to be able to exercise his skillful texts. Excellent check on that. Wow, look at this pressure. Stop! Stop! Look at this pressure. What is this? Prepare to strike now. So as we do this, I'm gonna make sure this is also running well on the YouTube side of things. So Free Blast trying to work his way in overhead by Akuma. There's a tech, but not anything you could do because it's canceled into moves that you can't punish. Look at this. Look at this pressure. I think that Free Blast is still doing a great job exercising his text, but what is he going to do against this? He's having a lot of trouble doing anything in terms of punishing or really taking effect for these different parries that he's pulling off. Alright, here we go. Jump back fireballs. Slide. Into grab. Nice tech. That's what I'm saying. She's doing an excellent job of text. Normally she can get a lot of mileage off that, but he's canceling into Tatsumaki's, he's canceling into Demon Flip, and there's not a lot she can do unless she finds a way to use meter. Excellent text by Sasuke Nagano now, but Free Blast takes a round. Here we go. Final round. Go for it. All right, so here we go. Nice tech by Free Blast. Gets the grab. Tech. Alright, some interesting super jumps just from Mabuki there. Akuma finds a way back in. Nice. You probably thought she could jump away. Look at this pressure. All the low. There it is. Too early, though. I cannot believe he just grabbed her. Nice tech. Look at this, man. Free Blast is not out of this. He can get this match. Gotta find his opening. Little, little, little button there. Wow, just reaches. Nice jump kick. Alright, so here we go. Alright, here we go. We're now on to game three here. Which one of these fighters is gonna come out on top? So here we go, we got game three. Akuma, that's blocked. That's parry. Okay, there it is. That overhead. Look at that stun. Wow, he actually went for the low. He's not been using that. But look at the DP kick right there. Nice work. Into the heat of battle. Go for it. Dank and Elian Rodriguez, I appreciate you following me on YouTube, bro. I normally on YouTube, what I do is I remix a lot of old school video game themes and hip hop beats. So that's a lot of the content I have on YouTube. I appreciate the follow, bro. That soup, he was having none of that. Final round. Now. Alright, nice kick. Nice straight punch there. Nice kicks there. Nice tag. Nice. Wow, that was an insane setup in the demon, but actually Free Blast found a way out. Uses the meter. He says, you know what, I need to get out of here. No. Sasuke doesn't allow it. That's a third game for Sasuke. Sasuke is your third strike online. <laughs> Fight for the future.